Hello, this is Silve Moon Dro, and I am going to be starting episode 3 of my Fire Emblem Let's Play. He is all so unbelievable. Perhaps the most famous sword in all K in my hand. It's not so strange. In fact, many legends tell similar tales. Special blades all over the land call out to their proper owners. And yet, when I saw you draw that blade, Lindis, I felt something extraordinary. That sword was waiting for you. You were meant to draw it. Stop it. I... I'm nothing special. Think of it this way. Some weapons feel more comfortable in your hand, right? Well, the Monocotti itself feels very comfortable with you. Does this make it any easier for you to accept? It doesn't appear that either of us can use it. It does feel right in my hand. A blade that only I can wield. That seems reasonable enough, I can understand that. Look at it, Ryoko. This is the Monocotti. This is my sword. I must care for it well. Sure, whatever you say, Lindis. Yay, Castle Kaelin. What? Madeline's daughter is still alive? Ah, uh, yes, Lord Lundgren. The girl is traveling with Kent and Sane. What are your orders? If we let them be... Bah, I've heard that Northern Burn is full of bandits. She's just a girl. She'll not survive her journey here. I'm more concerned with my older brother. His life must be ended quickly. The poison. There must be no blunders. Yes, my lord. He suspects nothing and continues to drink it. The mark he's... The Marcus's death, due no doubt to sudden illness, is not far off. Hehehe, <laughs> soon. Soon, Kaelin will be mine. Do 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 The secrets of her past revealed in the words of two knights of Lycia. Now, to meet her grandfather, Lynn heads west. To Lycia, and to her destiny, a mountain range separates the Ske Plains from Bern. There are many bandits lurking there, the cruelest of which are the Taliver. They wreak havoc on both Ske and Bern, and their savagery knows no bounds. On her tenth day away from the plains, Lynn witnesses their atrocities herself. Ooh, a pony! Pony. This place is... The entire area is in ruins. Why doesn't their Marcus do anything to help? Talaver Mountain is home to a gang of ruthless, v vicious bandits. No Marcus holds power here. My village was near here on the other side of the mountain. My people were... The Talaver bandits came at night. It took only one night. The survivors numbered less than ten, including me. They're soulless beasts. I will never forgive them. Never. Lindis. I am not running away. I will be back someday. I'll be stronger. I will break their swords beneath me like twigs beneath a stallion's hooves. I will avenge my people. I'll do everything in my power. When the time comes, bring me with you. Sane. Don't forget me, either. Kent. Oh, you too, Ryoko. I... thank you. Here. Do do. Wait right there, little lady. What are you going to do? Apologize, huh? Uh, I... that is... I... Hey, she's quite a catch, eh, buddy? I bet the boss would give us a pretty penny for her. Yeah, she roughed me up a bit, so I figure fair's fair. It's no more than she deserves. I... I... 
What are we going to do with her flying mule? Don't you dare touch her. What? You just watch your mouth, girly. Do what you will with me. Just let her go. Please, I beg of you. Ha ha ha, silly twit. Pegasi can only be found in Elia. They're rare beasts, worth more than you by far. We can sell it for a mountain of gold. Let it go, ha! No, you can't. Come on, let's move. Yeah! What's this? Be on your guard, Lindis. There seems to be some sort of commotion over there. That's... that's a Pegasus. Could it be? Florina? Is it you, Florina? Ah, Lynn? Florina, what are you doing in a place such as this? Lynn... Is... is it really you? I... I... Come now, no crying. I... I'm sorry. Your acquaintances? She's my friend. This is Florina, a Pegasus Knight in training from Elia. She's a little uncomfortable around men. Tell me, Florina, what happened here? Well, um, when I heard that you had left, I decided to follow you. When I saw this village, I flew down to ask if they had news of you. I didn't see these two, and, well, did your Pegasus land on them? Well, I... a little... Haha, uh -huh, you heard her. She admits her fault. She stepped on my friend, and now she's got to pay. Did you apologize, Florina? Yes. I told them I was sorry many times over. They just won't listen. Don't cry. It's all right. Lynn. Listen, she's obviously sorry. Can you just let it pass? If you don't, I'll file a harassment suit against you. You don't appear to be injured or anything. No chance. This girl goes with us. By force, if need be. Okay. Harassment suit is coming right up. Hey, come on out now, boys. The men are fair game, but don't put a scratch on the girls. Wow, sexist, sexist bitches. Ryoko, we've got to fight back. Lynn, I... You're a Pegasus Knight, aren't you? You can fight, can't you? Yes? Listen carefully, Ryoko. We're facing bandits. They're underlings, but we can't take them too lightly. Let's clear them out of here. Are you ready? The layout around here might make it difficult to fight. The same holds true for our foe, too. If we use these walls just so, they may ensure our victory, because we're badass. Lin, who's that? This is Ryoko. He's still an apprentice, but he's my tactician. Oh, come on, fucking controller. Oh, I see. Uh, Ryoko? I'm... Pleased to meet you. Red roof buildings are villages. Villages are in danger of being attacked. Okay. Okay. Do do. Do 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 do. Is anyone there? Leave us alone, you thugs. Go away. Go away. We've no more gold for you. No, wait, please. We're not bandits. We want to help the village. Please, listen. Remain inside, everyone. I'll go see what's happening. Hello, cool guy. Not bandits, huh? So, who are you? My name is Lin. My colleagues and I are just traveling through here. We saw some bandits, so we are going to deal with them, but we need you to go and warn the villagers. Hey, wait. The name's Will. I'm a traveler of sorts, too. Listen, these villagers have been kind to me. Mind if I fight with you? Not at all. We need all the help we can get. Come on, Will. By visiting a village, you we gained a new companion. Will's an archer. He uses a bow to fight. Bows can be fired at foes more than one space away. Obstacles won't affect your line of fire. Attacking enemies without moving next to them is called indirect combat. Blah, blah, blah. Screw this. When I started testing out this game, I got farther than this by a little bit. Oh. 
fine. Be picky. Yay! Sh shooting people. Fun. And I'm gonna have to end this part. So, yeah. Me adding in commentary makes it a whole fucking bunch longer. So, yeah. Um, see you guys next episode.